What's up, everybody? Sunday, back to the grind. Out here in Atlanta, Georgia. Unexpected trip, but we're going with love. Got our coffee, got our water. Stay hydrated and get that energy going. It's been a crazy week in the personal life of Valentino, you know? I've just been literally traveling around like the fucking eastern lower part of the United States. My Corvette's getting repaired right now. I was supposed to be done two days ago or yesterday, but not done yet. So we're still out here in Atlanta. We in South Carolina yesterday. We check out the other channel if you guys want to check out more of that stuff. But yeah, we're out here because this is an exciting week. I did not do any trades the past week because of NFTP week or NFP week. Had hella news going on, hella impact the news going on, and I was just travel around, didn't really want to deal with nothing, didn't want to stress about nothing. So best best thing you guys can do, not even trade. That's one of the best you guys can do because the saps are looking iffy, market's looking choppy, weeks looking terrible. You might as well just stay out, you don't have to worry about nothing, and get to it next week. And that's what we're doing. Beginning of the week is officially Sunday, October 9th. Let's see what's going on this week. And this is how I made 4K in one month trading Forex. So we got our buys in on Bitcoin. We're doing a little scalping on this little session today. Gonna go over the little charts in a second, but trying to see what's gonna happen here. This little scalp setup, so. She will break through the 0.618. If not, we're gonna close the long. See how she will do. Oh. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. So yeah, 0.618 zone, pretty much as it is. Pretty much in the long from here. Trying to go from the top of the little range. And then it might come back down. Retest off the golden zone, pop up, break the next resistance area. But we shall see. We don't predict where the market's going. We follow where the market's going. She's breaking through it right now. Let's see. Live trading with y'all. Oh shit, I got that shit. <laughs> Just breaking up, breaking up. Let's see. Checking a little bit on the one minute. We shall see. All showered up and shit. Put some gel in, you know, get all fresh. And then we're gonna go check out Georgia. Maybe go downtown Atlanta. See how it is. Got Bitcoin over here doing something. We shall see. And she's moving, guys. Closed one of the trades out here, like uh, a little bit in profit. Popped another entry there because I was pissed I closed it because she was just popping right back up. But she's moving nicely. Try to stick with the original plan. Lousy little $13 profit. Because I had to re enter with the spread. So we're down a little bit. Sitting here in this little range, like bow flag. Sorry for my screen, I didn't clean my damn screen. Fucking humidity in Myrtle Beach. Yeah, she would nicely miss that entry here, which would have been perfect. This little fallen wedge entry on that boy. It's been a choppy day. We we're looking at Bitcoin earlier. It was up here. Spike the hell down. K 
came down real quick on this big little drop right here. We're gonna show right now on Bitcoin and on gold. Let's see, gold position looking nice. Send your break even around like 100 bucks profit, mostly from gold, which is good. And yeah, I'm gonna lock in some of the gold real quick. Nicely done. Seen us seen a reject off the res resistance right here, and she's just falling straight into the profit. First target would be like right here, next would be at this support, and the next would be at this support. This is just how the scalp's looking right now. Yeah, this is patience, pays off. Glad I went downtown, was not looking at Bitcoin sitting in the room all day. So we're locked in about a hundred bucks so far. We got about 120 still running. I should lock in some more right here, so don't worry about it. So you should just have a couple trades a day, making a couple hundred. That's all you need. Get in, get out, and relax. Cause those add up. Just say like 250 bucks times 30. That's a pretty game, good profit a month. So she's reversing a little bit. I'm gonna close that out, close this one out to break even. And it's got Bitcoin in there. Negative around one six. Oh, that means we're made a lot more on gold than I thought. <laughs> but yeah, about 300 bucks on gold so far today. Just locked in. Got a three minute scalp right there. <laughs> I'm glad you guys be able to watch it and do it with you guys real quick, but. Big one's kind of fucking around, going back and forth. Overall, we did make a higher high. Actually, let me clear this up. Get a fresh chart for you guys, all right. So today's August, or October 9th. Bitcoin has been inching up, itching up. Making higher high, higher high, higher high. Pretty much with some rising in this rising channel. But people will say this is a bear flag. Pretty much if we do break out of this, it'll come on down to the next area, which would be around the support around here, around 18 grand. So yeah, I'm in a shirt right now. Sitting your break even around 73 bucks. So let's see what's gonna happen, but yeah. I'm just gonna keep looking at this, keep a small risk. If it does push up, just take out the trade for today. At least we made some profits, but that's pretty much it. Pretty much how the trading day goes with me. <laughs> Glad to start off the week with some profits locked in, which I'm happy about, that's good. And yeah, a decent day, not really too much today. Went downtown a little bit, seen the area. Just hella traffic in Atlanta. It's not really too much to show you guys. But yeah, pretty much this is how I made 300 bucks today. Quick little trades up at the Atlanta, leaving tomorrow, heading back to Kentucky, picking up my car, hopefully. Hopefully my car is done. And yeah, it's pretty much it for this video. Please like and subscribe for more though. I will see you guys next time.